Space agency officials have confirmed that uh, studies are underway to assess whether astronauts could be sent to the red planet to establish human colonies, but it won't be cheap. And there's a catch. There will be no coming home for those selected. When the alignment is right and the two planets are at their closest, the distance between Earth and Mars is 36 million miles. That's like flying around the world every day for four straight years. But traveling at spacecraft speed, it's estimated the trip could take between six and nine months. How much would it cost? Well, NASA originally estimated $10 billion. But Google co-founder Larry Page has expressed an interest in funding it. If the space agency can get the price down, in his words, by one or two billion. But the cost of engineering a return back to Earth would be extortionately high to the point of being unfeasible. So this would be a one-way trip. Astronauts would stay living on Mars. According to experts, Mars is the planet most likely to have substantial quantities of water. But they would, of course, have to figure out how to get to it. And they'd be, caught, uh, they'd be operating in an oxygen-free environment where temperatures could plunge as low as minus 140 degrees Celsius. That would clearly mean that this is not a mission for the faint-hearted. But the Americans are not the only ones hoping to make this giant leap. China, India and Russia are also in the race to set foot on Mars. Together, they account for more than a third of the world's population. So might just be able to find one person prepared to say goodbye to planet Earth for the rest of their lives.